All right, Sarah, and the city of Erie are also preparing for the potential storm. They're rounding together equipment and supplies to work on the streets. Our Keelan Berrien has more. With the turn of a key, these trucks light up and is ready for whatever Mother Nature has to throw at them. Plows are on, all the spreaders are checked, uh, everything's ready to go. The snowy conditions can be an inconvenience on driving, shoveling, and car brushing. The latest data shows Pennsylvania as the fifth most dangerous state for winter driving. But Rhonda Grindelwald isn't bothered by that. She brushes off her car and incorporates it into her schedule. It's um, easier to uh, just come to terms with, hey, this is where I live and that's what I have to do. And if you don't want to do it, then move. This year's winter didn't give us a lot of snowfall, but there are plenty on their salt supply because they decided to get an early start on stocking up. But Somberger wants everyone to abide by the odd and even days so it can make it easier for plowers to scrape the roads. Well, what we try to concentrate is on the inner city during the day, and then we branch off to our outlying areas. But in the inner city in the morning, if we get a lot of snow, we also do the main runs on all, our, all around town to keep the main arteries open. The pandemic hasn't affected the city. They are fully staffed and equipped with plenty of trucks. We've tried to get things in early, like our salt supply. Parts for the truck. Uh, we've been pretty lucky there. We stock quite a bit in our municipal garage. Keelan Berrien, Erie News Now.